Hello there man, in the last CS 1.6 video I showed you how you can add up custom plugins. In this video I'm going to show you how you can add up your own extra items to your zombie mode. And for this example I've chosen the Balrog 1 pistol, alright? So now you might see like uh, you might see the SMA file or only the MX file. But basically this is very important because we're going to be editing up our weapon's name and the damage. And without this file, we cannot compile compile it to this file. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, now I use uh, Notepad++, but some of you use M M the Mod X Studio. And uh, I'm gonna explain you why you should not use that. Because the program is slow. It is good, but it runs slow. And it causes up for you to crash the the program itself. You know what I'm saying? You can use like Notepad, like me, or other type of uh, programming stuff. Like I know lots of people use other things, but my personal preference is Notepad. Say so yeah, I'm going to edit this with Notepad. Now, as you can see, there is lots of shit in here, but we're going to find the thing that changes up our plugin more like the weapons name because we need to edit that as you can see in here we found what we have needed so in here as you can see it's balrog one but i would li like to edit just one like this and make sure you do not want to remove this one and this one like nothing in here don't remove anything expect you can change the name of your weapon inside from this area so now this is the damage of the weapon when it says damage in here and this part for the weapons part of course is the explosion damage and now in here it's 300 with a dot i don't know why but i'm going to change it to 500 and now the damage in here is 2.5 and i would like to decrease it a little bit to 2.0 so basically we're done Changing the weapon's name and the damage, alright? Now we're going to click up on save. I will personally change the name of the weapon. Like I will change it to something very related to zombie. Like ZP underscore Balrog1. As a personal preference, you can choose up anything. So now we have saved up this ma file, alright? So yeah, now you're going to go to your file locations of CS 1.6, you're going to go up on CS track, add-ons, Amazon mode. In the last video, you have installed your Amazon mode X, right? So you'll see this file called scripting. Now you go in here, you add up the file which we saved, and now we're going to drag it up to compile the file. Or, that, or otherwise it won't work. As you can see, Compilation time is, I don't know, 0 0.75, but we already are good, man. Well, if it says done in here, you can click up enter. But by the way, this is how it shows up with a CMD, alright? That's the best, easiest way to compile the file. Now, you're going to go up here and you're going to check the compiled folder, right? You're going to double click it. And as you can see, this is the file which we compiled with the custom name which I added. Now, as you know, you just rename this, copy the entire name. Now, you just add it here to the plugins, boom. Now, in my case, I'm using a different type of mode. Like, it's not... I mean, it is zombie plague, but uh, with other type of menu. But basically, you're going to find this plugins z plague in it now you double click on this you can add it anywhere you want man boom i added it like this so yeah just click save on this so yeah this is how you add an item an extra item to your zombie plague mode so let's test it out in the game man now we're on the game and as you can see on the sixth slot i've added a weapon and this is how it should be in your zombie plague mode too but as i said i have a different menu where i can get the weapons in your case it would be with clicking m clicking 2 which is the item the extra item section and you will see the weapon there and boom and that's about it man 
see you in another CS 1.6 video. Peace.